Just three months ago, Riyak Machar was sworn in as first vice president. He's now been replaced by his chief negotiator and former mining minister, Tabandeng Gai. The move indicates tensions within the opposition, but President Kir has downplayed the issue, saying the implementation of the 2015 peace deal must continue with or without Machar. Of course, this agreement cannot be personalized that if X is away, the agreement will be held until when that person comes. Deng Gai, who is now the commander-in-chief of the opposition's armed forces, says his responsibility is towards the thousands of South Sudanese who have been displaced from their homes. I struggle to bring you out from the suffering you don't deserve to be displacing your own country. The Joint Monitoring and Evaluation Commission, which oversees the implementation of the African Union backed peace deal, is prepared to work with Dengai. If the IO agree among themselves, they make proposals to the president and he accepts, uh, we welcome that.